Part 3. Directions. You will hear some conversations between two or more people. You will be asked to answer three questions about what the speakers say in each conversation. Select the best response to each question and mark the letter A, B, C, or D on your answer sheet. The conversations will not be printed in your test book and will be spoken only one time. Questions 32 through 34 refer to the following conversation. Hi, Karen. I wonder if you can help me. I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow afternoon, so I need someone to take my shift at the restaurant. No problem. I can do that. Would you cover my shift next Monday evening in exchange? Of course. I'll let the supervisor know about the change in schedule right now. Number 32. What does the man say he has to do tomorrow? Number 33. What do the speakers agree to do? Number 34. What will the man probably do next? Questions 35 through 37 refer to the following conversation with three speakers. Hi, Ken. Hi, Julio. How did the art gallery opening go last weekend? Was the client happy with the marketing materials? Alfredo? He was very pleased. He said he thought the brochures we designed were one of the main reasons for such a great turnout. And it's worth checking out the gallery when you have some time. I'm sure Alfredo would be happy to give you a tour. Yes, the place is so bright and modern with a fantastic collection of local works of art. You know, I'm taking a vacation in that area in February. I'll make a point of visiting him. Number 35. What were the men doing last weekend? Number 36. What type of work did the speakers do for Alfredo? Number 37. What does the woman plan to do in February? Questions 38 through 40 refer to the following conversation. Hi, I'm Petra Barlow. I have an interview for a position in the accounting department here at Houseman Incorporated. Hello, Ms. Barlow. Let me check in the computer. While I do that, would you put on this visitor's badge so it's easy to see? Yes, of course. I'm supposed to meet with Helen Wade in meeting room 2B, is that right? Actually, it looks like there was a last-minute change. You'll be meeting in room 12A instead. It's down that hallway and to your left. Thanks a lot. Number 38. Why is the woman at Hausman Incorporated? Number 39. What does the man ask the woman to do? Number 40. What does the man say has changed? Questions 41 through 43 refer to the following conversation. Good afternoon. I currently subscribe to your Gold Plan satellite television package. I'd like to switch to the Platinum Plan because there are some new movie channels that I'd like to watch. Of course. I'd be happy to help you upgrade your subscription. Could you spell your last name for me so that I can look up your account? Yes, it's K-W-A-N. When should I expect to have access to the extra channels? Your account will reset tomorrow at 6 a.m., so you'll be able to watch them first thing in the morning. I just want to remind you that an extra $15 will appear on your next monthly bill for this expanded service. Number 41. What is the conversation mainly about?
Number 42. What does the woman ask for? Number 43. According to the woman, when will the change take effect? Go on to the next page. Questions 44 through 46 refer to the following conversation. Hi, I've just unloaded the last box of bathroom tiles. The whole deliver is in your warehouse now. Would you be able to sign for them? I need a signature. I'm sorry, this is my first day on the job. I'd better check with the warehouse manager to see if I'm allowed to do that. Should I wait here while you check? Actually, if you wouldn't mind moving your truck, that'd be great, since we're expecting some other deliveries shortly. Number 44. What does the woman request? Number 45. What does the man say he has to do? Number 46. What does the man ask the woman to do? Questions 47 through 49 refer to the following conversation. Okay, Ms. Torres, I have your price estimate. To have the whole exterior of your house painted, including the fence, will cost you $5,000. That's quite a bit more than we expected. And actually, Colgate Painting said they would do it for $4,000. Well, the cost of paint and supplies is included in the price I quoted you, so we really offer a very good deal. Well, that's a bit of a relief. If there are no other charges, we'll probably be able to stay within our budget. Number 47. What are the speakers discussing? Number 48. Why does the woman say... And actually, Colgate Painting said they would do it for $4,000. Number 49. Why is the woman relieved?